Hi, you're with Chandeep at Gurli and let's take a look at the floor function in Excel. Just like the ceiling function, which pushes the number up by a factor, this function pushes the number down by a factor. Let's take a look at this example here. We have 10 products and we have their sales price. So let's say if you want to find out the nearest multiple of 5182, but that, that multiple should be smaller than this number. So I'm going to say equals to floor and pick up this number. So floor asks me for two inputs, number and the significance. Significance means the factor. So I'm going to pick up this number and I want to push it down by a significance of 100. So I'm going to say 100. So now the nearest factor, which is smaller than 5182, which is also the multiple of 100, is going to be 5100. And you get that. You drag the formula down and you will get the nearest multiple of 100, which is going to be smaller than this number. So that was a floor function. It is just pushing down the number by the nearest multiple of 100. I hope you like this video. You can follow us on Facebook, Twitter or on YouTube and you can also read the blogs at goodly.co.in. Thank you so much for watching this and you take care of yourselves. Bye-bye.